I used to stick my neck out uh. Just for them to turn around and wanna see me bled out uh. Gotta keep an evil eye, they try to put a hex out None of you can mess the quality, you feel like threat count yeah. Used to have a lot of fucks to give, now I'm fresh out I don't believe in trying to impress women with their game plan Yes, okay, okay I'm, I'm belie I believe that you do what you want to do, basically, as a man, right? You have a you have a destination, right? And you're on that destination and that path, and you should be followed. I don't think you should try to do and change for what a woman wants. I don't believe that. It's like, I don't, a crazy thing that people talk, I don't believe in relationship therapy. I don't believe you should have to work on being with me. No. Why do we have to work on it? All right, you pause, 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 pause. Put a pin in that for a second, because this will this help me understand something. Do you believe in therapy period because if you do if you believe in therapy as an individual it will be hard pressed to say i'm going to dismiss the group therapy i don't believe in therapy period okay okay let, okay, let me tell you fine, this let me fine, tell you why fine let me, fine because okay, so you get it because yes because you couldn't believe in one and not the other so if you don't right. believe in it as a whole that makes complete sense to me I would have fun. I would definitely have fun with a therapy. It's, I wouldn't, you know what's crazy? I'm gonna take that back. I wouldn't say I believe in therapy. I, I don't believe in therapy. I don't need therapy. I do need somebody to speak to at times. And I guess that'd be called therapy. Yes, <laughs> but, bro. but but as far as like a, a, a set professional a set setting, plan, a set plan for what I need to do to take steps forward so I can succeed. Fuck no. I'm you not saying that, you know, just give me somebody, weird. maybe somebody to talk to with, with some of the things and, and concepts I have in my head. Yeah. That, but that's just needing somebody to talk to. Hey, yo, is it, is therapy just like a life coach? Cause you go and you be like, Hey, yo, I'm sucking. My life is effed up. Nothing's going well for me. And they like, what I'm going to say is this. I'm not too sure what therapy is, but I'm not going to take away from their profession. All I'm saying is that no. I have enough real conversations with people that I don't need to find somebody I can have a real conversation with. Okay. Okay. You know what I'm so it's like, I, I don't, I don't need that. I, I should, right. I get white. I get mad if, if, if I got to go to therapy to fix something. So somebody else on the outside had to help me fix something that I was trying to work on for 17 years. Yeah. I mean, come on, bro. I'm not, nah, I'm not believing that shit. Like, come on. That's just, and then you got to go to them forever. Yeah. Think about this. And is he going to give me a, 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 a one shot deal where no. I go see him once? And no. it's like, oh shit, I don't even no. come back no more. You, you're it, actually right. Dr. Zismore. He going to write you a prescription to come back in two weeks. Yeah. And sit nah. on his couch again for another $200. Nah, nah. You already know what you, you know, uh, I said what you are. You already know what it is. Your boy, Ronald West. And I'm here with Xavier Carnegie. And this is Say Word, where we talk about all types of topics, random controversial topics with a humorous twist. So hit that like and hit that subscribe button if you like this type of content. And if you're going on 500 hour days, bro, put it in the comment, bro. Because I, I don't think I, I don't I, I don't think you should do that. That's all I'm going to say. No, five. You know what? I would put, yo, yo, if I was single, man, I'll put that type of shit in my budget. That's, but again, again, though, Ron. But to have fun, that'd be fun. If you're for me. going out on five, if you going out and spending five hundred dollars every day when you go out as an individual, then yeah. But if not, then what's the purpose? Well, some for some people it's five hundred dollars. For some people it's fifty dollars. Correct. And if you you're going out every day and spending fifty dollars, then double that. Make it a hundred dollars because times two and take her with you. Check this out. I can have something for every single man out there that's going to help them get dates. This is real easy. Put it in your budget. And I, I'm going to mix my philosophy mixed with Xavier philosophy, right? So I believe you should pay for dates. And so does Xavier. He said the first date, right? So, but here's one thing he's not going to agree with. I believe every single man should put in his budget, whatever it is your budget is. It could be 20 bucks. I don't care what it is. But you should treat a young lady to a meal with that 20 bucks once a month. If you're single, once a month. This seat, now you got 12. If, you, if it doesn't work, you have 12 opportunities a year to establish a friendship or a deeper connection with somebody, with a young lady. Boom. That's all I'm saying you do, and I bet you you'd be successful. Bro, you, you're shaking that your head. You, that, see, that's that's good advice. Don't believe it. Don't I'm believe saying, it. If you got 20 bucks, don't it don't matter what it, it is. And if your you know what? You know what? 20, if your board is more than 20, then you spend fact, more than fact. 20 because you are single. You, you know what? Single. As you saying it, and I'm getting ready to say no, but, 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 like, I like anime. Like, I'm single. I'm out. I'm at the anime anime conventions every and every time they pop up. I'm at all the anime meetups and shit. Maybe the chick that I'm treating to lunch is at those anime meetups. You dig what I'm saying? 
and so fact 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 but the way you saying it is like that's because you got to be careful because the way you saying it is almost sound like bro find you abroad and look for abroad just to just to, just so you can take her to lunch Exactly. And I think that's not the right answer. Exactly. You that's go not the right answer. So I'm just going to yellow pages. You want to call some chick no, no. random chick? No, no, no. You meet somebody, you have a cool conversation. And see, my my tactic takes personality and, and it takes learning. And if you don't have personality, you can learn, you can read, you know. So I have a little geeked out approach with it. But I'm saying once a month, you you find a young lady and you ask her, can you take her to What's your thing? Coffee, Starbucks. You can go to Starbucks. You can start there. You can start paying for Starbucks, even if you can't afford Applebee's. You could, you could, you could, you can work your way up. But what I'm saying is, you should put it in your budget because I think it's important to have that type of um, relationship with someone. No, I, I, I guess I'm not, <laughs> all, the best I can do is I'm going to take you where I'm already going. That's it. That's I'm not making no extra plans. It's not nothing crazy. Okay, yeah, it's the same thing. It's no, not go, the same. If you're thing. gonna go, oh, look. If you're gonna go, let's say every let's every third Friday of the month, you go to the park to look at the view, sit on a rock, smoke a blunt, and eat um General Toe's chicken. Okay, bring somebody with you. Okay, fact. Okay, okay, okay. That does that's interested in the same thing. Yes, but see, and, that's, and this see, the way. Hold on, hold on. Let see, me go. You got to take my see, You see what I mean? Hold you see you go deeper. Hold on, hold on. Clarify. You clarify. You ask her. Would you be into going to um, Eagle Rock and playing Pokemon? Cinema Rock. No, I like no, to play Pokemon. I like to play Pokemon. Can you and and smoke weed and eat General Toast chicken? Would you Would you want to come with me? In, in, in no particular order. In no particular order. <laughs> that's would you join me? Yeah. Yeah. And 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 look, look, okay. So if you're gonna check this out then. So so I'm gonna add on to that. She might say no. But guess what? You don't change that approach. You keep that general towel, you keep that Pokemon, and you keep that Saturday, and you keep trying. Right. Don't change it. Don't right. say, oh, my Pokemon ain't working. No, because you want the chick that's gonna play Pokemon with you, son. Right. Yeah, that's I don't believe it. Yeah, you I don't believe Pokemon, in Justin. That's yeah. the one you want. Yeah. I don't believe in adjusting for uh, what a woman that, wants. That's what I'm. That's what that's I'm trying to say. Work. No, no, I'm not saying that. Come on, exactly. Ron, Ron, Ronald had you walking into like Shoprite and and the local Wegmans, just walking up and down the aisles, <laughs> asking cashiers, "Do you want to get something to eat?" Like, because you might work in. You might work. In, you see, you. <laughs> I guess you might have to. Let's say you work in like in a steel mill. Ain't it too many broads running around in the steel mill? Right. So you might have to go into the like the local yeah. shop, right? <laughs> Don't just say hi. Just Ronald say will have hi. to be in a creep, bro. Just say hi to a woman and smile at her, and then you'll be good. You and know you're gonna I mean? be on TikTok, and they're gonna be calling you. They're gonna be calling you out all type of all type of creeps. Don't be going around smiling at people. You see what happened when you in the gym, bro? Don't be going around smiling at people and think you're gonna get away with that, bro. Yo. You're gonna be on somebody's TikTok. Ronald, Ronald gonna lead you astray. We need more. We need more gentlemen. We need more guys to pay for dates. That's going to help the whole economy out because we need more relationships. We do need this. We need more men to step up. And I'm and I'm look and I'm one that says and I like some of the toxic masculine stuff, some of it. But you know, calling women out of their names constantly, putting your hands on women, I'm not into that. But leading a woman, on you, then you can pop up. But, she spit on you, you can jab her. But listen, leading a woman because you're the man, the most dominant, the strongest, got the, the lung capacity. Yeah, that that is what I'm definitely preaching. We are the catch. So we check are the out, catch. Bro. We it's weird. We're the catch, but we still have to be gentlemen, and we still have see, to come through see. with old school values. That's see, what I'm saying. See, see. But none of the women are coming with old school values, so it's a little one sided on that perspective. That's the first part. Hey, say real quick, you you conked out for I, a second. I said I said most women aren't aren't coming with with old school uh, female values. So you come in with the old school uh, traditional man values, fine, so be it. If that's what gets you going and you sticking with that rule, fine. But to the other point, if if you're if 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 men are the catch, right, and they're and they're and they're bringing the the most to that situation, they're carrying the the heaviest load per se. Why aren't that goes back to my almost my original statement? Why aren't you treating me to dinner? Like if I if I am if I am so much of, of, of the catch and I and, and I'm I'm carrying so much of that load and I'm so awesome. Why aren't why why is it 
not feasible for you to offer to take me out on a date. It's come on. It, I I think it's a give and take. But this I, is what I'm saying. Okay. Why well, does well, listen, why, why, why does one side get okay. have to give so much more than the other? Okay, why not? I get I get what you're saying. But why not stick to traditional old school values? Because it's not traditional old school on the other side. Not everyone. So the approach is the approach might have to be a little different. But what I'm saying is I said, I, man, you know, as I said, I told you what type of person I am. I'm taking a shot at full court. And yeah. before only when the ball is released, I realize like, oh, shit, that angle is kind of off. But right before <laughs> the ball is released every single time, even if I were to take a shot right now, I feel like it's going to go in. OK, that's what I'm asking for men to go in with with that type of confidence. And so what if you fail? It's just like missing nah. that half court shot. Come on. Go. man. Uh -uh. Go. And this is why to me, this is why. Things have been so watered down, man. No one can take an L nowadays. Whoa. Every woman, whoa. Hold on, hold on. Every woman, so are, is a man supposed to be 100% when he goes to dating and when it comes to when it comes to relationships? Every date that he goes on to, should that turn into a relationship? Hold on, pause, stop, right there, no. I mean, you're hoping it does. Should it turn into sex? But it, what? Should it turn into relationship, sex? What is it supposed to turn into? A deeper friendship, like help me out. There's so many different things it can turn into. Bro, man, you hoping you smash, bro? That's what it all boils down to, bro. Let's let's stop it. Let's stop it. And then if it turns into I a relationship, that's so big because bro. we not walking around, bro. We not walking around like, damn, bro. She just looked like she holds a good conversation. <clears throat> that's not what nobody's thinking. So stop it. It's like, yo, she looks good, and hopefully she can hold a good conversation. So so to say, sex wasn't on her mind at the, at that time. Like, come on, stop it. That's the bullshit I'm trying to say. Like, can't, you know what's crazy? That's a hundred percent honest. I, I think it is. I think it is because I, I just know how I think, right? I, I, you know, yo, I just know how I think. You know what I'm saying? When when I went on, I remember going on dates. I never, I didn't think, I didn't say never, but I didn't think that this is going to turn into sex tonight. Okay, but hold on, hold that thought one second. Hold that thought. You said right. You got to pay for the dates, right? Right. And. You you out there courting and you, you, you shoot your shot, and you know for like it it might be a a forty percent catch rate from you know what I mean ten baits put out you might only get four people to bite right so you might be going on let's just say four dates a month five dates a month I don't know you're you're, you're checking these broads out but all these broads trying to get food so you might be going on six dates a month because I always everybody trying to get something how much money do I got are you fucking kidding me that shit adds up. Girl, now I'm going on five or six dates a month. You know what? You know why? You know why? You know why I'm getting. See, I'm I'm taking it more analytical, and I get what you're saying. If if at a certain time, a certain age, I'm not successful, those dates and me not being successful with those dates, after a while, it can't be them all the time. At some point, there's got to be somewhere I can work on. And then for me, hey, yo, like I said, I, for me, I would have to figure out what that thing is I need to work on because. I got to get me a woman. I'm always going to be with woman. I got to find right. out which woman that's going to be. So I would take my chances all the time because I got it. Whatever it is you got. If you got $40 you. a month, you're going to put $40 mm -hmm. a month towards it. That's what I'm saying. This would be like a subscription. I will have a subscription fee, Fuck but Fuck taking that. women no on way. dates every single no month. Way. That's how I would no do way. it. Hey, yo, throw everything Ronald said out the window previously because this guy is living in a fantasy world. I'm trying to tell y'all. But you know I'm keeping it real. think like regular people. Don't follow this cat, bro. I'm I'm gonna say F it. F the budget. F going to look for, for some random chick to give your money to to say, let me buy you lunch. F it, bro. Keep going to work. Keep going to the gym, bro. Keep being a dope nigga. Bro, your solar system will make them come to you like a magnet, bro. Well, you ain't gonna have to go find them. Well, let's F, F what Ronald talking about. Bro. I can tell you this. I can tell you this, right? It's a lot of women. I don't get along with women a lot at all. I don't. I don't. I think different. I think like a man. I think like a man. But I do believe I love the old school values of this. Like, ah, oh, man, I love that. You're taking your woman out. You're whining and dining her. You're getting her whatever she wants. But that's your I woman. You into, already, you know, but look, no, before, you already got it. You, before you get a woman, you got to operate like that. You got to operate like here, that. Bro. No, no, Yo, no. There's no, no way a woman's going to just let a bro. Girl, this, I, I, I just... It's bro. just hard for me, yo. You know what bro, I'm saying? Taking advantage. Hey, yo, you, you know, know why? You, you know, know why? I'm not gonna lie. X, X. I'm not gonna lie to you. You know what the problem is? 
I'm looking, I'm thinking about this vessel that God gave me. Uh -huh. I got to take myself kind of like out of Ronald. <laughs> that, that's the problem because I'm like, it doesn't like I would be old school values. You understand? Because I'm, I'm with old school values. Men provides, they do a lot of shit. Correct. They do a lot you of things. Like yes. A lion. Yes. yes. So, so I feel, well, and, like a male lion. I protect, provide. And, and with that whole, and this is what I'm saying, bro. That's, that's a hell of a role that you're taking as a man. You're taking a lot of responsibility. You're taking a, a heavy boulder, bro, to carry this family and to lead the lead a whole separate human being, bro. Like you're taking such a responsibility, and everybody is not worthy to be to, to to fall under that umbrella of care. And this is why I'm such an asshole through this process, bro, because I need to put you through a rigorous process to make sure you're worthy to go through that. Because I think I'm just that fucking dope. So for the one at fault that that that's gonna that's gonna rock and roll to the end, bro, you're gonna have to go through a gauntlet. Because I think, I, I, bro, the same way women feel a prize, I feel that as far as a man and leading leading the family and taking care of everything. Right. So I, I I just feel my approach is a little more rougher. Because right. I feel the reward at the end is just that much greater. I used to stick my neck out uh, just for them to turn around and want to see me bled out. Uh, Gotta keep an evil eye, they try to put a hex out. None of you can mess the quality, you feel like threat count. Yeah. Used to have a lot of fucks to give, now I'm fresh out. I would find so much joy in Ronald's single life ex escapades. Because just like with most of the stories Ronald tell me. <laughs> I'm gonna be sitting here and he gonna be like, X, let me tell you about this shit. <laughs>